Hello WordPress bloggers, welcome to another tutorial from How to Webmaster. Today I'm going to show you how to automatically save images from external websites. For example, here I'm at Pixabay and I want to save, let's say this image. I'm going to copy and then paste it onto my blog. However, if the image gets deleted from this website, then my image on my blog will also be deleted as well. And that's why it is sometimes better to save the images to your blog server. And there is a plugin to automatically save images from external websites to your WordPress. And this way you don't have to download the image and then upload it to your WordPress, save you some time. The plugin is called Automatic Upload Images. It is a free plugin and you can download it and install it directly from your WordPress admin dashboard. Under plugins, click on add new, search for automatic upload images. And here it is, click on install now. And then click on activate. Okay, the plugin is activated and that's pretty much it. Let's create a new post to see how it works. All right, I'm going to just copy this image right here. Directly copy image and then paste it. And then paste it in just like that. And let me try to copy just some random images here from Wikipedia article. I'm just gonna copy that and paste it in just like that. So now these images are still, if I click on open image in new tab, it is still at the external website right here. You can see it is linked from uh, Pixabay, the image. Let me give this a quick title. And now it, when I save or publish, let's publish, the plugin will now automatically download the images, save it to the server, and then automatically edit the source images links from uh, my server instead of the external website servers. Now view the post, and now if I go to open image in new tab, it is now from my website. It's saved to my website instead of the external website. So the images are now safely saved to my server. And I don't have to be afraid of images getting deleted from the external websites. Alrighty, that's all for this video. I hope it helps. Thanks so much for viewing. Be sure to subscribe to How to Webmaster for more WordPress tips, tricks, and tutorials. Thanks again, and until next time, happy blogging.